All right, <clears throat> my pocket juice is expecting. This is like nine months. Let's see if we can open this up. <clears throat> I don't think it lasts that long either. If I can get the battery, if I can get this open up, I might put take this battery out and put it in one of my solar lights. I will deflate it and then put it outside. all on camera just to see if I can cut my hand. <clears throat> all right, so this doesn't seem to be latched. It's just pressed closed. Yep, there's a latch. Mmm, smells like lithium. I got that can. <laughs> oh well, folks. Oh man, why is it tighter down here? Because of the plates? I think that battery is like in love and expanding. Now that it's got more room. Something, something creaking. Just turned itself on. Come on, man, give it up. What the hell is holding it in place? Don't want to. You don't want to stick stuff in because then you'll short. You'll you'll poke your battery. Is the battery glued to the top here? You know what's going on? Started tape. I'm gonna get that plastic spatulas. People that don't know, the, the, the fingers of glue, oh, you can't see it. The fingers of glue is that white, and I'm just raking them with the knife. So I'm not at risk of puncturing the battery. It's not my first radio. Rodeo, you see all that white in there? That's just the filament of the, of the glue. 
for the double sided tape. Eventually, we will. Damn, look how balloon this battery is. Wins. See? That's just a clip. That's not me. The knife did not cut this. Look at this puppy. We got one in and one out. Damn, look how fat that boy is. Damn. Damn. Yeah, see, that's all. That's all air. So. I might pop a hole in this to get the air out. Of course, I'm going to do that outside or I'm going to die from this little amount of air from the lithium. And then I'm probably going to stick this in a, uh, in a solar light outside. Oh, we can't see the... Oh, it's 5... It's 5 amp. It's a 5 amp. So even if it only lasts for like two amps, that's way more, or one amp, that's way more than what the solar light was doing. So I think I'm going to do that, because I have a solar light that needs a 3.7 or a 4.2. And this thing will still charge. It's just that it's dangerous. Oh, there we go. How could you open? So this thing was still working. It's just that, you know, the battery's a little better than it was supposed to be. And you see it's at three charge. Pocket juice. Now how do I? Oh, I gotta rip these off. All right, this battery's set at 3.9 right now. I got our solar open. It should light up at 3.9. Oops, I forgot the switch. I don't have it fixed yet. <laughs> so you can't power the battery side because the switch is shot. So, got our light on. Got our solar. The solar panel, okay. Should we do it? I poked the hole right there to let the the, the fumes out. See, out in the yard, you don't care about the fumes. I could duct tape it, but it's just gonna blow up again eventually, I suppose. 